Welcome to another relaxed conversation with JB and Summer G, where we talk about real estate and other local shenanigans. Hey everybody, welcome to our relaxed conversation. I'm JB and this is Summer G and we are here today to talk to you a little bit about what if you found a house, might be an ugly duckling, might be grandma's house, right? It could have lots of funky wallpaper or original craftsman details, maybe we could say. Mm-hmm. What happens if you find that perfect spot, but it needs some lovin's, but you want to get a mortgage loan? Summer is going to talk to us a little bit today about her personal experience in going through that process. Yeah, so um, it exists, renovation loans. Uh, it's not a dirty word or it's not anything that's scary. Uh, they're actually pretty easy to do. And the reason mm-hmm. I know that is because I personally did one when I uh, purchased a house last year. Uh, I found this really great mid-century, uh, beautiful house, ma- amazing neighborhood, the backyard. But mm-hmm. I tell you, the bathrooms were still from 1950. Mm-hmm. Uh, we had one with the uh, mint green <laughs> tile and the other one had that mauve yeah. pink color. Uh, it was ta- tragic. Um, So I was able to roll in the cost of doing those renovations into my mortgage. And I was able to do it up front to where during my option period, which we'll talk Mm -hmm. about that at another point, uh, I wanted to make sure that I interviewed contractors enough to get a really good feel for what that project was going to cost because Mm -hmm. I wanted to make sure that I was going to be able to get the project done within the budget that I had to work with in the financing side. Um, And doing that during the option period allows you to, if for some reason it wasn't, I would be able to step back and maybe that wasn't going to be the home for me. Um, In this case it was, everything worked out. Uh, And there's also a lag time between when you close on the mortgage and when your first payment is due. So for example, I closed on the mortgage at the beginning of July, but the first payment is not due until Mm -hmm. September. So I was able to stay in my apartment until September. So they had all of July and all of August to get majority of the work done so I didn't have to move into a construction zone. So there's obviously tons more details that we would love to chat with you guys about. Um, So feel free to give us a call and we'll answer any questions that you guys have. Yeah, absolutely. Have a great day. Thank you, everybody. Have a great day.